man, who would have thought killing vampires would be so much fun? Yeah, and at least with this, I can kill as many people as I want as long as they're vampires. War familiars. Right, right. <sighs> Um, Ego, do you think it's a, a little troublesome that our son is, what, so used to killing? Yes. This is part of the reason why I didn't want him being a vampire slayer to begin with. Right. Well, in his defense, yeah, it was to save me. And because you are a busy, <sighs> damn, you the way I, hmm? What is it? Don't you smell that? Someone's here. He's gonna take it out of the sword, blade, he's doing the same. Well, 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 we go say hi. But before they go inside, Blaze. Wait, I know that's about. He's like, wait, don't as Izuku skewers the intruder and pins him to the wall. Damn it. Uh. Oh. Um. Whoops. Damn it. Get, get your sore out of me. Pause. Wait. Please. Phrasing. Shut the fuck up. I ain't got time for that shit. As, yeah, he pulls out his sword. Just... Sorry, Uncle Logan. <sighs> time I'll call first why didn't you before don't get smarter me hey Eric Logan so uh, besides my son nearly gutting you how you been nothing much I'm trying to follow up on some leads when it comes to Dracula <sighs> If anything, it's a pain in the ass to deal with. But still. <sighs> at the very least, that guy knows how to keep, your, uh, keep you on your toes, at least. <sighs> Damn. If anything, it makes... Makes it so much more difficult to do our job if he just keeps making more of them. Well, one thing for sure, as soon as you kill him, you won't have to worry about, you know, the old stabby stab, especially me. How's I supposed to know it was you? You should have my scent marked. You should know how I smell. Yeah, you smell like. Beer, aftershave, and don't you don't I understand. You, you can't you can't blame him for <laughs> for that, Logan. Like, oh no, I can. Only thing is, I can't kill him. No matter how much I really try. <laughs> hey hey hey! I don't like getting skewered either. I may be immoral, but it is a bitch. I still feel the pain. I know. To be honest, it's your fault for sneaking. I'm gonna kill him. You've tried that before. Hmm. If I release, got any beer? 
You know I do. And I'm pretty sure you already healed yourself. I can smell the open beer cans from here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can't help myself. Mm. Yeah, you're just a drunk. Hey. I, I resent that. Hey. You drink a lot. You're drunk. Wrong. I don't get drunk. Even if I do, it doesn't last very long. So, it makes sense to drink as much as I want. As fast as I want. <sighs> what kind of fucking logic? Oh, right. That, that reminds me. Fury wants to talk to you. What? Yeah. He wants to talk about that thing you guys discussed. What? Dad, what is he talking about? Um, nothing. Nothing, nothing at all. Eric? Mm. Yes? Don't lie to me. What? Uh, uh, mm. We can talk about this later when we get home. Logan? May we leave? I don't know. I kind of want to see this how this turns out. Don't be such an ass. Get your son to stop stabbing me. Mm. Fine. I'll try. <sighs> but right now, I'm tired. And uh, we just got back home from a successful night of some the killing so if you don't mind uh, <sighs> really yep fine fine but if anything next time you're buying the first round I don't see the point in you pretty much drinking knowing that you won't get buzzed for too long. Well, at least I don't have to worry about uh, alcoholics and ominous. Fair point. Fair, fair point. As yeah, the next day, Izuku and Toga are pretty much alright. <clears throat> We're off. Oh, right, you're having that interest exam thingy. Oh, yeah. <sighs> I'm so proud of you, my boy. Yeah, thanks, Dad. It's just... <sighs> I can't believe... <sighs> it's been so long. Yeah. If anything... I am really happy you decided to, to go in my stead when it came to saving your mother. I wish you could have done better with the slaying, but eh, oh well. D -d -d don't be an ass. Just saying. As far as the practical exam goes, Ichizuku and Toga, since they did go to the same school, yeah, then they're not in the same area because Izuku, yeah, he's using his skills as well as the multitude of practice he's had and easily takes care of the robots. He just sees them as uh, bloodsuckers, making it so much more easier to tear them to pieces. When it comes to Toga, she already had the killer instinct. And she was all too happy to actually rip and tear into something else. Just to see if she could. As you say, vampiric strength really comes in handy. 
And yeah, they actually tie for first place. When it's the first day of UA, everyone can tell that they're a thing. Especially since Toga won't let go of Izuku's arm. Everyone who saw Izuku instantly recognizes him. The same could be said for Toga. I should say there are a lot of heartbroken men and women there. <laughs> Toga, what is it? You can let go of me now. I could, but that would imply that I want to. It's everyone, they see that they're a thing, but they just want real confirmation. So, yeah, Mina, being the way she is, think, what is your relationship? He completes me. That's all she needed to hear. <laughs> Mineta, him, just silently being pissed. What? Nothing. No, you said something. You do know my quirk gives me vampiric abilities, right? What? I wonder if you bleed, do you bleed grape juice? Or will it be like wine? As he sees Deku's eyes start glowing, as he flashes his fangs and is like, Please don't eat me! And everyone sees, he's like, Okay, what's going on here? Is he really going to say, He's a girl. What? I thought I was supposed to be the crazy one. He insulted us. He did now. Then, allow me to correct this. Her just grabbing Mineta and slamming him straight to the ground. Listen here, I am, um, for some reason, I can't kill you. But that doesn't mean I can't beat the ever-loving shit out of you. Uh, I don't want to risk turning you. What? He's could just smacking her upside the head and say, Woman, you're going to get us scarred. Elgar, okay, you're one of your seats. Hmm? Oh, hello, Mr. Aizawa. He's a girl. Yeah. Toga. Uh huh. Oh. I don't get paid for this. I don't get paid enough for this. As yeah, this is as soon as the core comprehension test ends. Is Izuku and Toga tied for let's say second place? Let's say Momo still got first. On one end, Izuku he feels defeated. On the other, he doesn't really care. But. He knows Momo. She's she's not a jerk. So if anyone will get first place, I guess she deserved it. Yeah, the only thing is he still won that first place spot. As did Toga. Oh well. You can't really help the past. When it comes to the locker rooms. Toga is actually the one who knows is the peephole. But as soon as she tries to look through it, she's like, What the hell? It's covered. Her looking around, she's like, Hey, uh, earphone jack girl. What? I, I, need your, I need your cork for a second. Why? There's a peephole here. Uh, oh, wait, so you want me to make sure the boys aren't trying? No, I'm trying to take a look. Wait, why? Curiosity. She totally wants to look at Izuku. Shut up, Momo. <clears throat> it's like, wait, y'all know each other? It's complicated. It was, yeah. 
getting a sneak peek of uh, whatever one uh, has to offer. Yeah, she's really not interested. When she looks at Izuku, she's all too happy. It's like, uh, I'm happy, but he's my first. <laughs> what? Everyone looking Momo was like, Choga, you're not supposed to say it. You need to, you need to work on your phrasing. What? He is my first. What do you mean by first, Mina? She's just wanting to like, yes, please tell us. What do you mean by that? So, uh, let's just say he was very kind, gentle. Oh, and those teeth of his, when he bit me. <laughs> Toga just receiving a smack upside the head by Momo. It's like, you idiot. No one's supposed to know you. I don't care. Well, Izuku does, and what if, what if I tell him that you pretty much spilt the secret? Oh, you wouldn't dare. I would. He might not like you anymore. In fact, I might be able to take away all his attention. <laughs> Her gang slammed straight into the wall. Izuku noticing this and listening in. So they cannot be serious. What? Nothing. It's nothing. It's like, Damn it. I can't believe this shit. Why do why, why, why I gotta, why I gotta associate myself with such crazy women? What? Am I a masochist or something? I mean, Toe is one thing, but Momo. Come on, girl. <sighs> this is nonsense. As now we cut to the helicarrier. Alright, Fury. What's this about? You know exactly why I want you here. <sighs> For the last time. Or at least the millionth in second. No. All I'm asking is that you help boost my soldiers. N yeah, no. I, I, I'm not doing that. Why not? Well, for one, no one really needs a, a vampire army. But what if it helps us with Dracula? Yeah, that might be helpful to you. Heck, I'm just happy that our last fight left him so vulnerable. Yeah. Now he has that w damn weakness. Yeah, he can finally get burned by sunlight. I, I am so happy. Makes it so much easier to kill that prick. <sighs> well, fine, if you won't term my soldiers, my man or nothing. Can you at least consider my proposal as for Izuku? What, him being part of the Howling Commandos? Precisely. Yeah. <sighs> Listen, Fury. I I respect what you do. I mean sometimes you fuck things up for you being too ambitious. Uh, yeah, but I really don't want my son being associated with you. Why not? Because you probably go behind my back and get him to turn all your people. Uh, come on, I would never do I need to bring out the list of people you were supposed to help, but ended up fucking over with your little cockamamie experiments or wanting to protect people. Uh, fair enough. At the very least, how's Hulk doing? <laughs>